Like the other witnesses before him, Port Authority Commissioner Pat Schuber said he had no knowledge of the GWB lane closures and deplores the deed. When Bill Baroni was saying that this was a traffic study, what did you think of his claim that it was a traffic study? I, I, look, I had a great respect for Bill Baroni. Um, you know, as far as, as his work was, I had no reason to question him with regard to that. I mean, he, he was always a, you know, a, a valuable staffer, I thought. Did you do anything to try to investigate whether the bridge, clo bridge lane closures was uh, proper? No. Do you believe in your failure to raise these issues that you fulfilled your fiduciary responsibility to the Port Authority? I, I believe that, I, the answer to your question is yes, I do. I believe that I have served the, the, the commission or the Port Authority Commission um, professionally and ably. Schuber is the former Bergen County executive and a former Republican assemblyman Governor Christie asked him to serve on the Port Authority Board of Commissioners in 2011. It's a prestigious position, but it doesn't include a salary, and lately it's brought headaches. Are you glad you took that position? <laughs> As I said, I wish my battery had been, been depleted on the day I got the call from the governor. <laughs> Schuber is the first Port Authority Board member subpoenaed by the Select Committee on Investigation. Like the Republicans on the committee, he'd rather talk about Port Authority reform than any misdeeds. He was asked about Governor Christie's suggestion in March that the PA maybe be split into two agencies. Go, having gone through what I've been going through over the last several months, I, I actually almost thought that that was a good idea. Are there changes, significant changes that need to be made? Yes. Um, does the authority need to be blown up, so to speak, and, and, and removed? I don't think so. I think that's draconian. Um, and I think it's throwing the baby out with the bathwater. I, 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 I have to say that my experience at the authority in the short time that I've been there has been that the overwhelming number of its employees at all of its levels are extremely professional. One reform he supports is ending the practice of the executive director coming from New York and the deputy executive director from New Jersey. It creates two lines of authority that go in two different directions. In essence, one goes to Albany and one goes to Trenton. Committee Democrats also focused on a large Port Authority toll hike that was reportedly orchestrated to protect the two governors, and on a letter Senator Loretta Weinberg sent Schuber requesting some follow-up. Schuber shared that letter with former Port Authority Chairman David Sampson, who emailed back, what a jerk. Weinberg asked why he ignored her. I saw this very quickly becoming a political football, and from my perspective, I just didn't want to be involved with that. At the State House, I'm Michael Aaron, NJTV News.